Closing things out with a look at what is trending with our digital producer, Trent Gilbreth. Hi, honey. Hi, CP. What's up? Oh! So we're going to kick it off. Uh, that little Save by the Bell music is something that is trending right now. But some great things on our Facebook page is uh, Chick-fil-A is celebrating Cow Appreciation Day for its 15th year. Yes. So you dress like a cow. You wear an accessory. You just wear anything Aww. cow moo related. And you get a free entree all day today until 7 o'clock. That's great. I got to do that. Let me yeah. think. Let me think. Yeah. Just well, Stick like a headband on the girls. Put, yes, call it a day. Thing. Tag at ATL and Co on Instagram if you do it and you had your way to Chick fil A. Now, Vera Bradley, do you ever do any of these designs oh, and yeah, luggage? I've and had Vera Bradley, of, of course. Of course, of um, course. So, iconic brand, but they just merged with Crocs. What? An interesting club, yes. So we posted this yesterday and people are kind of freaking out. It's already been sold out. It was just released a line earlier this month. Okay. Um, and they're glowing off the shelves. Those are adorable. Oh. You think so? Cute trends. We heard uh, from Amy. She tagged Tyler. She said maybe he can up his game. I'm guessing that Tyler, her husband Tyler, is a Crocs fan. And Minna says, um, no. Oh, Minna. Uh -uh. There were some that were less. Um, I won't use the word busy, but I, I okay. just did. You know, that were a little more understated. I'm all about a busy pattern. I don't like the croc. Oh, oh no, okay. I'm with you. I, yes. I don't love crocs, but yeah. I like the pat. But there were some Definitely. flip flops I saw in there. True. True. So, yeah, yeah but but I'm not a Crocs person no, 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 either. No, no, no. Yeah. Finally, we're ending with the summer of 89. Today's show is celebrating 30 years since 89. Um, so, of course, Save by the Bell, New Kids on the Block, uh, The Game Boy. They're being uh, all week long. And I have a little pop quiz. There's Debbie Gibson and Tiffany, of oh, course. Oh, Tiffany. For yes. Christine. What do you think was the number one best selling hit uh, on the Billboard charts in uh, 89? In 89? All the year. Um, you show Deborah Gibson only in my dreams. Let's hear it. I don't know. Janet Jackson's yes. Miss You was number one. That one in like a Phil Collins jam. Ah, oh, Janet, I love it. Later. What a way to end the show. Thank you, Trent. And thank you for watching. I'll see you back here tomorrow.